Start with special breaking news coverage tonight on Night Team as the nation mourns the loss of one of Michiana's own. I'm Tiffany Salme. And I'm Tim Spears. It's a tragedy. ABC 57 News broke into programming for with wall to wall coverage all afternoon. Tonight, we remember the life and legacy of Indiana U.S. Congresswoman Jackie Walorski. It happened here near State Road 19 and State Road 119 north of Napanee around 1230 this afternoon. Police say a car traveling in the opposite direction crossed the center line and collided with Walorski's car. Here's some footage from the scene which stayed active for about four hours while crews cleaned up and investigators reconstructed the scene. All four people involved in the crash are now dead, including two of Walorski's colleagues and a 56 year old Napanee woman, Edith Schmucker. Tonight, we're looking back on the life and legacy of Congresswoman Walorski and the other victims killed. The two others in the car during the crash were her colleagues. Zachary Potts, an IU grad, was Congresswoman Jackie Walorski's district director at the U.S. House of Representatives and the chair for the St. Joseph County Republican Party. Emma Thompson was Walorski's communication director. Jackie Walorski is a lifelong Hoosier, born and raised in South Bend. Walorski and her husband, Dean, previously spent four years as missionaries in Romania, where they started a foundation to provide food and medical supplies to impoverished children. The congresswoman also worked as a television news reporter in South Bend in the late 80s and as a developmental director for colleges and universities in Indiana. She was raised with the Hoosier values of hard work, determination, and public service. She brought these values to her service in the 2nd District of Indiana. Both Emma and Zach had already developed lengthy careers in politics despite only being in their 20s. Zachary Potts, only 27 years old, worked with Walorski for more than three years. He worked as Walorski's campaign manager and coordinator. He's also the chair of the St. Joe County GOP, the second district Young Republicans chair, vice chair of the St. Joseph Republican Party and victory team captain of the Indiana Republican Party. Potts also volunteered at La Casa de Amistad, helping teach native Spanish speakers the English language. Mishawaka Mayor Dave Wood also spoke on the impact Zach had on the local community. He served as an inspiration for, for many, and, and it's an unimaginable loss. Uh, struck down right in the prime of his, his youth and just getting ready to start a family of his own. Um, and I, and I, I'm, I'm still at a loss for words. Emma Thompson was only 28. She was also very involved in politics and served as Walorski's communications director for more than a year now. Before that, she was the campaign manager for Dr. John Joyce for Congress. She worked as a digital communications assistant for the Democracy Fund and as a press assistant for Marco Rubio for president. She was also an intern in the U.S. Senate.